going on YouTube? You know, a lot of us today are on a ton of social media facets, such as Bookface, Twatter, Tumblr, and Mammogram. Those aren't those, that's not it. But one in particular has been on my list of interests, and that's your Facebook status updates. Oh. And I really got to thinking, some of the stuff that y'all put up as updates are just, ugh, goddamn. So y'all already know what it is. LG Awesome, baby, let's get it, let's go! Number one, fuck your Facebook updates. Let me tell you something, nobody cares what's going on in your life every 10 seconds. I'm eating food. I'm chewing food. I'm shitting food. Oh. Biatch, nobody cares about your ghetto circle of life. Bitch, I got two other friends I'm trying to Facebook stop, and you are making it difficult for me. Number two, why are you using Facebook to post about real problems? Hmm. There is some real shit that you are Facebook posting about that you should not be doing. For example, why are you Facebook updating about a crime that is happening right now? Oh my god, I'm witnessing a raping. What do I do? Call the motherfucking police! You decided to go ahead and Facebook status update the situation instead of calling the cops. Hmm? Uh, let me ask you here something stupid. Did you ask them to stop so what? You can Instagram them first? Hold still for a goddamn second! Try to get the right filter. Number three! Stop posting up shit so people can compliment your sorry ass. Oh my god, I feel so ugly today. Oh. Look at here, Blowfina. We all know why that you do that shit. It's because you want all your god friends to leave you comments and thumbs up your status update. No, you're a sacred, beautiful jasmine flower. One word to describe you. Beautiful. A word, Mr. Ghetto Shakespeare. I got a few words to describe your ass. Corny ass motherfucker! You guys are the sorriest creatures on earth. The funny ass thing is these guys actually think that if they leave that compliment, just maybe she'll remember and look my way. Woo. Motherfucker, the closest you are ever gonna touch her is probably in your dreams with Pamela Henderson and Angela Johnson. <laughs> Number four, stop posting up pictures of food that you just made. Why you ask? Because they look like shit. I'm not talking about you making a delicious and intricate meal. I'm talking about you making a damn sandwich and typing Look what I made! It's a sandwich, bitch! What you want, a cookie? And more importantly, stop posting the pictures of food if you can't cook. Just because you type homemade in front of that shit does not mean it looks or even tastes good. You know what else is homemade? Dookie. And from the looks of it, your shit looks just like that. Last but not least, number five. Stop posting up song lyrics. Ladies, do you know why guys post up lyrics on their Facebook status updates? It's just so we can show you that we have a sensitive style. And about 90% of your Facebook status updates are Drake lyrics. Now, Drake, I've said this before and I've said this again. Motherfucker, I hate your guts. You honestly have the darkest eyebrows on earth. That shit look like two lines of straight gunpowder on your face. I don't hate you, Drake, because obviously you're doing something right because everybody quotes you. Motherfucker, I hate your guts. But I swear to God, if somebody else quotes, but the key under the man, you know I be over there. I'ma shave your motherfucking eyebrows off. Oh, I'll do it. If I could find you. Oh, check it out what is going on. So, important announcement. I'm going to be at Honolulu Collaboration. That's right. And it's going down on the 18th. So, if y'all are in the area, in Honolulu, you know, in the Hawaiian Island area, check me out. It's going to be a dope-ass show. There's going to be some other performers coming out. Description and stuff is going to be on the link. My information might be incorrect. I don't know. But um, check out the description in the links below on the, sh on the show more information part. You know, the part that you guys never look at. But anyways, check me out. It's gonna be dope. It's gonna be real fun. So, um, I hope to see y'all there. And uh, this looks like the beginning to a softcore porn that nobody would buy.